What's up YouTube? Jeff back again today with a very exciting Samsung video for you guys. Today we are going to be talking about One UI 6.0 Beta 3 and we're going to be talking about a pretty cool new feature that there is inside the update process for One UI 6.0 and something that I noticed recently and also some other tech outlets have been publishing about something you guys should definitely know about. We're going to take a look at that today. Before we get started, I do want to thank my son Jonathan giving us a animal to hang out. Today we have the hippo over here sitting on the side for the video. We always appreciate him. Also want to remind you guys about my partners at Mint Mobile. Mint Mobile has unlimited premium wireless right now, just $15 a month. So if you've been looking to upgrade your wireless service and also do so at an amazing price, this is one of their best deals of the year. It's a limited time only offer and they have data plans that fit everybody's needs. Of course, they have their five gig plan, they have their 15 gig plan, 20 gig plan, and their unlimited plan. Right now, since all of the plans are $15 a month, this limited time offer, of course, you might as well try out the unlimited plan. Get unlimited talk and text, nationwide coverage. You also get mobile hotspot included as well on all of the plans. You see right there, 40 gigabytes of 5G, 4G LTE data. Right now, just $15 a month, $45 for three months of service. I've been using them now for over 10 months here in the Phoenix, Arizona area, and I've had absolutely amazing service. I know a lot of you guys have tried them since I've been talking about them here on the channel. And if you haven't now, this amazing deal is a great time to do it. Go to trymintmobile.com slash Springer. The link's also in the pinned comment and description. Check out Mint, get this amazing offer. It is only here for a limited time. So make sure you guys do it today and let me know how much you're loving the service in the comments below once you guys give them a try. We do appreciate Mint. For being partners with the channel so i want to show you guys this amazing new feature um, when i updated to one ui 6.0 beta 3 i'm also going to talk a little bit about one ui 6.0 beta 3 stability and battery life because i know people want to hear about that stuff too but this is another feature that i found if you go in the settings here and take a look at my most recent update let's go down to software update and uh if you go look you see i updated on september 14th and you can see if you tap here you see sort of all the features that came One UI 6 to Beta 3. Now, one thing you don't see here is if you actually look, and I'll show you guys in the screenshot. Let me go off camera really quick because I got to go on my gallery. I want to make sure I don't have any family-specific photos that uh, I don't want to show off. But uh, you'll see right here that on the actual screenshot, you can see where it says App Updates. Let me scroll in on my scrolling screenshot. This is the one I actually took right as I was updating. You can update apps along with the software update at the same time, and you could click on this and choose apps to update. Now, when I did this, I actually did not click on choose apps to update because I was so excited about getting One UI 6.0 Beta 3, making a new video for you guys with all the features. I didn't check it out, but I did notice it, and I wish I would have checked it out at the time because now some people have posted about what this actually does. So I grabbed this screenshot, I think it was from Android Police, um, showing someone else who actually did tap on this during their um, software update process, and this is what you get. So it says the apps you select below will be updated automatically after the software update is complete. So you've got a bunch of Samsung uh, apps, AR Zone, Calculator, Calendar, Clock, Editor Lite, Galaxy Shop, Wearable, Game Launcher, Pen Up, Reminder, Samsung Account, Samsung Core Services. So basically any of these that you tap and you have toggled on, they'll automatically update to the most recent version after you do the update, which certainly streamline things really nicely for those of you out there who don't wanna to have to worry about doing extra updates, Obviously, I'm checking all the time because I make these kind of videos and content update videos for you guys. So I always am kind of dialed in, but something less that you have to worry about when you're doing your updates. Now, keep in mind, though, a lot of these can also be updated via not only the Galaxy Store, but also the Google Play Store. So if you toggle one of them off, um, you could still get an automatic update from one of those stores if you have automatic updates turned on in one of those respective app stores as well. So it's just giving you an opportunity to update all of them at once to their newest versions. A lot of times some apps that are built in like the Samsung stock apps, especially calendar, clock, reminder, those get updated with the new One UI version. So this really streamlines the process. And it's another example of Samsung trying to make things easier. Um, in some sense, trying to make things more Apple-like for their base users while still giving those pro users of us some extra customization. So let me now also talk about really quickly one UI 6.0 Beta 3, the experience. So far, this seems like a really like master release candidate, stable release candidate. The, the animations have been fantastic. I've still noticed a few bugs going in and out of the recents menu, a little bit of freeze ups and some weird stuff there. But for the most part, I haven't had any major issues. 
The animations seem really fast and fluid. I know people are always going to say they can improve them, but they've done a great job. And uh, it's definitely not as many stutters as there were on the past beta releases. Now, banking apps still don't work on here, so you're not going to get your Google Play. I use PNC, I use Fidelity, I use Bank of America. None of those applications are working properly right now. So if you want to do your banking on the go, you want to use your mobile payments, that stuff's not going to work. Battery life's been really good for me. You can see right now it's at 3 o'clock. i got 75% left. Today I've been doing a lot of work, so I haven't been on the phone heavy. But overall, I've definitely been getting back to or above what I was getting on the One UI 5.1 stable, somewhere around five and a half hours screen on time. That's with pretty heavy use, and also I use Android Auto for about 35 to 40 minutes driving into work and going home. Wireless Android Auto really kills the battery, so I'm probably getting a little less than most people would get out of this device. Um, otherwise, everything else about it has been a fantastic experience. Um, they're not really adding a lot of crazy new features with each release now, so I'm really thinking that we're going to see the stable version coming out sometime in October. It looks like mid to late October, so for those of you guys who are waiting to see that stable version release, it's most likely coming out in that sort of range. Um, my guess is probably late October for the S23 series. We're probably gonna have one or two more betas, probably go up to beta five, make sure everything's dialed in, and then they'll release it. One other thing I will say I really like is the blur. They've gotten down the blur on the quick settings absolutely perfectly. They've also made that swipe gesture from the top corner a lot more fluid and easy to recognize. So they really have made some subtle improvements that really improve the overall usability of One UI 6.0. And I think when the stable version rolls out, you guys are gonna absolutely love it. So it should be coming soon to you guys. This week, we're also gonna see the Fold 5 finally get One UI 6.0 beta. Of course, I'll be making a video on that. That should be out this week uh, by Friday, the 22nd of September. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification icon um, for, for videos like this. Again, if you guys wanna save some money on your wireless service, Check out my partners at Mint Mobile. Try mintmobile.com slash Springer, also in the pinned comment description. Amazing deal right now. Unlimited premium wireless, just $15 a month. Limited time offer. Take advantage of that. We appreciate them for being partners with the channel. Appreciate you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.